projectile motion from a height. Here we are going to calculate time of flight. It is denoted by capital T. The particle is dropped from certain height h. So at initial stage, it moves horizontally. Due to the acceleration due to gravity, it comes down and reaches the earth. Right? So here we are going to calculate time of flight. It is denoted by capital T. What is time of flight? At what time flight comes to the earth? Right? At what time flight comes down? So that's the equation we are going to derive here. So completely with respect to y we have to derive. Observe here ux that is initial velocity with respect to the horizontal we can take it as u. Uy is 0 and ax equal to 0 ay equal to g. Right? So take s is equal to ut plus half at square. S is equal to ut plus half at square. To derive time of flight equation, consider vertical velocity that is with respect to y. So apply y here, sy uyt 1 by 2 uyt square. Right? So here sy is nothing but h. So what is ui? ui is 0, 0 into something 0 plus 1 by 2 ay you can take this as z so here for t is nothing but t square right capital t now h is equal to g by 2 t square now cross multiply 2h by g is equal to t square t is equal to what under root 2h by g Right? T is equal to under root 2H by G. So this is the equation of time of flight in the case where projectile motion from a height. Right? So students, please subscribe Max Guru channel. Here you can watch Max as well as physics video lessons which are useful for mains, advanced as well as neat. Thank you very much.